Hey guys, my name is Heather Mallory. I am a professional makeup artist and today I'm going to show you how to do this really fun mermaid beach like look. So if you want to see how to create this look, please stay tuned and watch my video. What we're going to do first for this look is we're going to prime our eyes and I'm using, I like to use like Painterly or soft ochre paint pot. Um, I'm using Utterly Becoming right now, which is very similar to um, Painterly Paint Pot from MAC Cosmetics. I'm just taking my 242 flat brush from MAC Cosmetics using that paint pot. And I'm going to prime each side of my eye. I start from the tear duct and then the lash line all the way up to the brow. And this is a really nice color because it is so neutral. It just blends in with my skin tone. I'm going to be using a color from my palette. And this is all my greens and blue eyeshadows from MAC Cosmetics. And I'm going to be using Lucky Green, which is just a really pretty green from MAC Cosmetics. And it's going to be this shadow right here. And we're going to put that all over the lid of our eye. And I'm using that same um, brush, the 242 brush from MAC Cosmetics. And I'm just going to press it into the lid of my eye. So now what you can do is you can add any highlight color that you want. I generally always use nylon because it looks really great on me and it's my favorite color. So this is nylon from MAC Cosmetics and it's just a really bright like creamy yellow. And I'm using the 227 short handle brush from MAC Cosmetics and I'm just applying that right under my brow bone. add a little bit of nylon in the inner corner of my eye to really highlight it so I'm going to go back in with my 242 brush and nylon and just really highlight that inner tear duct of my eye Now we need a transition color. We're going to be using a few different colors to do this transition. First we're going to be just using a neutral brown and then we'll add some variations of teals and greens. So my first best friend color for my transition is brown script and this is just a reddish brown tint. You could also use saddle if you don't feel like you want that reddish tint. The brush I'm going to be using is the 286 Mineralize blending brush for my eyeshadow and I'm just going to start it on the outer corner doing circular motions and then blending it into the crease. Okay, so I'm going to be using an aqua color. This one is from MAC Cosmetics and it's called Aqua. So I'm going to be putting that also with a fluffy brush into my crease. I'm using a different fluffy brush. This one's the 224 brush from MAC Cosmetics and I'm going to be just kind of adding that color just right above the green. Use Kelly Green and Plumage for this look because I kind of wanted that natural mermaid look. So this is Kelly Green and then this is Plumage. But if you wanted to, you could use Electric Eel too if you really want it really bright, like Nicki Minaj kind of eyes. So I'm going to take the Kelly Green first, which is this green right here, and just add that to the outer V of my eye. So 
So this color is Plumage and it's kind of like a dark teal. And I'm just using that fluffy brush, the 224. And I'm just going on the outer corner. See, that's pretty dramatic. And we will have to go back in and kind of touch up a few colors. All right, so I'm gonna go in and touch up that teal, the aqua. There it is. So the next step that we're gonna do is we're gonna do this really pretty teal eyeliner on the bottom. And this one is called So There Jade by MAC Cosmetics. And it is a pencil eyeliner. And I'm just gonna start from the outer corner and just kind of bring it across my lash line. I'm gonna be using Black Track, which is a gel eyeliner from MAC Cosmetics and an angled brush to apply this. So I'm gonna be using the 263 angled brush that you can order online from MAC Cosmetics. I'm gonna be starting on the outer corner of my eye and just kind of drawing a slight triangle. Kind of like that and then you'll wanna do the inner part too. Okay guys, I'm going to use my Prep and Prime Eyelash Primer, and it's just a white. I'm going to do on the top lashes my Studio Sculpt Mascara from MAC Cosmetics. I'm gonna do the Zoom Lash, and I got this a while ago. It's from MAC Cosmetics, and it was, and it's called Green is Green. And I never wanna run out of this mascara because I absolutely love the color. And it's like this really pretty like aqua green. So I'm gonna do my bottom lashes with that. Just kind of cleaned up any foliage under my eye. So I'm going to be adding two blush colors to my cheeks. One is a highlight and it's called Full of Joy from MAC Cosmetics and it's this really pretty like purpley pink color and I'm just going to use a 129 brush to apply that and I'm just applying it right on top of my cheekbone. It's so pretty. So we'll do that to the other side. And then I'm going to add a pink blush to my cheekbones. And I'm going to use Peony Petal from MAC Cosmetics. It's this really pretty bright pink. Next we're going to do lips. You could do a few different lip looks for this. Um, you could do something really bold or you could do something really nude. Um, it just kind of depends on your own personal style and what you kind of feel comfortable in. Typically if I was going to go out during the rest of the day with this look on, I would do a pretty like neutral lip um, just to go out. And I probably wouldn't be wearing like matching earrings and a matching top um, unless I was going to like a party or an event. But just for every day, I probably wouldn't go as dressy as this. Um, so I would do like more of a nude or really pastel pink. I have this YSL um, lip stain and the color is number 17. And I love the brush on this. It's amazing. It like molds right to your lip. It's perfect. And it's very hydrating. Even though it's a stain, it's really hydrating too. So I'm going to add some extra sparkle and shine to this look and I'm using a Dazzle Glass from MAC Cosmetics 
and this color is Funtabulous. It's a really pretty sparkly glittery color. So that's the rest of our look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you like the color that we did today. I love wearing greens and blues so this will kind of like open up your ideas to color. I absolutely love wearing color. It just depends on how the color fits your personality and whether you feel comfortable wearing it or not. Not everybody's into color right at first. It kind of takes some wearing and getting used to and then you'll fall in love with it. So this look was created for you guys today. You could add a white eye pencil to the waterline if you wanted to to make this look a little bit more dramatic, but I kind of like it as is. And I kind of like how the green mascara just really pops on the bottom. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed the color and the Beachy Mermaid look. If you want to see more of my videos, please comment me below if you have some ideas or suggestions for me. I would love to hear them. Please like this video and subscribe to my page. I hope you guys have a wonderful and safe holiday. And God bless.